Hello, this is Anurag Shrivastava from Health in India. From the days of Sushil, who was considered as the father of surgery, the advancement in the general surgery has have reached to an extent where you just need to be in the hospital for a couple of days, and that's it. There was a time when people used to go for open surgery for whatever condition it may be, but today keyhole or the main medicine invasive surgery, as it is called, has taken over everything, every other uh, procedure. Unless and until it is utmost important, no surgeon would willingly go for an open surgery. And that's very, very true and very easy to understand because of the minimal complications that it has in the less number of days it ha the patient has to stay. Of course, the cost is also less because of the number of days that, that the patient is staying in the hospital. Uh, today, I am joined by one of uh, a very, very experienced laparoscopic surgeon who has an experience of more than 28 years in the field of laparoscopic surgery and has done almost all kind of laparoscopic surgeries including appendectomy, hernia, stapled hemorrhoidectomy and everything. He is a champion in all kind of laparoscopic surgeries, has worked with biggest hospitals and, and, and has had a uh, hand-on experience of more than 20-25,000 surgeries in Australia. Please join me to welcome Dr. Devi Shankar Malik who is currently the head of the department of laparoscopic surgery at uh, Metro Hospital Jaipur at Mansarova. Talk to Dr. Devi Shankar Malik about what kind of procedures he is doing at the hospitals and what all and about okay, Dr. Malik, tell me something about the kind of experience that you had in surgeries and what kind of surgeries you are doing basically. Actually, I did my MS in 1985 from the Jaipur Medical College. Then since then, I am continuous practice of general surgery. Then of late I started this laparoscopic surgery also. In 2002 I got my basic laparoscopic training at Institute of Laparoscopic Institute of Surgery at Calcutta. And then in 2010 I did my advanced laparoscopic surgery fellowship at Max Hospital, New Delhi, Saket. Since then I am continuously doing laparoscopic surgeries. More commonly the gallbladder surgeries, the appendicectomies, the ovarian cysts, the laparoscopic assisted vaginal hysterectomies. Then uh, Hernias, inguinal hernias, or as ventral hernias, and seasonal hernias, or almost all type of hernias. We are doing when you pass out here. after doing your MS, then the focus was mainly on the open surgery or laparotomy, as we know it commonly. Uh, how has this changed with the advent of the technology of minimally invasive or laparoscopic surgeries? Means how comfortable you are because you are coming from an era where you have been trained initially in the open surgeries, doing open surgeries, then transforming from uh, doing open surgery to a laparoscopic surgery, how that paradigm shift has happened and how it has helped the patients in the longer run? Actually, the time when we studied, there was no laparoscopic surgery as such. It was an era of open surgery, each and every surgery was being done by open method. But since 19, late 80s and 90s, when, since when laparoscopic surgery came, this the mindset of the people also changed because of the various advantages of the minimal access surgeries. It took lesser time, it took the minimum measures or it took the minimum incisions also. And cost was also very less, the patient recovery time was very good and less than as compared to open surgery. So the trend almost altogether changed from open surgery to laparoscopic surgeries. Since then, the laparoscopic surgery came and nowadays is the choice of the people as such, is the demand as such that they want the laparoscopic surgery and hence we also trained ourselves in laparoscopic surgery and we are doing the laparoscopic surgery as such.